Holy moly. That was hard. All right. What do we got going on this week? This week, we are two weeks out from Big Sugar, which is my last gravel race of the season. So final, final week of training. Um, I've got two kind of key workouts left this week to get after. So today I've got one of those. <laughs> what do we got going on? Uh, today's workout is a change of pace session um, to really simulate the first hour of Big Sugar. And it's just three rounds of 30 seconds all out, 15 seconds recovery. Um, just really simulating someone attacking, going super hard, possibly pulling onto their wheel. You get about 15 seconds, easy spin, go again. So eight of those, um, I think it's three or four minutes recovery and then a second round and then three or four minutes recovery, the third round, three rounds of it. What kind of watts are you shooting for? I'm not looking at watts this time of year and coming off being sick. It's more just all I have and picturing the race. It's more a mental exercise. We've got under two weeks till the race and just getting in the right mindset, pushing the legs as hard as they'll go. <laughs> Quick recovery, do it again. So, yeah. <laughs> I don't look at numbers or heart rate this time of year or more specifically just right now coming off of, yeah being sick, the rad, knowing it's the last all out effort. So that's what I, those are the watts all out. <laughs> What's the total time of the workout? How long are you gonna be riding? Um, I'm gonna be riding for about 90 minutes today. The workout is 45 minutes total. So I'll do about 30 to 40 minutes warm up right now get the body ready break a sweat um, try to simulate a little bit of what I'll do on race morning as well at, at Big Sugar like a 30 minute warm up with some pickups some leg openers and then yeah get into the three rounds okay ready to roll <laughs> I've got my cheer squad ready so got that support on course today <laughs> I've probably got another 40 or so minutes of warm-up before I start okay well I will let you warm up I'll check back in when you're in the pain cave <laughs> perfect <laughs> Going. 
Ouch. How are you feeling, Beth? Well, I'm just embracing the pain. This is exactly what the rad race start was like, and it's exactly what Big Sugar will be like, so. Just priming the mind and body for the pain, still pushing through, not giving up, pushing just one second longer than when you think you can't, when your legs are fully loaded. Because right now, it doesn't matter. Meaning, if I completely blow, if I completely can't push any second further, but this will give me that little bit more on race day. So. Didn't change the workout. Gave it all I had. Hurt so bad and kept going. That's all you can ask for. Hi, Stephen. Hi, babies. Come here. Stats. Whew, yeah. How'd that go? Um, well, I'm gonna have to refer back. <laughs> I think pretty good. It's different than like 30 30s. You get 30 seconds, so you're getting full recovery. This was actually just 15 seconds, so barely getting recovered. It's just like a slight slight easy pedal and you're going again, so. Um, yeah, I think it was solid. I haven't done these consistently since probably the spring, so. 
Solid effort. Happy. And channeling that for two weekends time. <laughs> I just kept picturing Sophia or Lauren attacking on one of those first hills and having to hold on. <clears throat> and that being the difference of making a group or not. So I'd rather make a group than be alone, solo, time trialing for a hundred miles. <laughs> Hope you guys got a little bit of something from that and uh, we look forward to doing this more in the future. We'll see you guys after Big Sugar.